Hey guys, Stephanie here. Please hit that like, subscribe, and share. All right, Trump, his head is only worth $80 million. How insulting, right? What is going on? You have Ilhan Omar and Rashid Tlaib fundraising to support the Iran terrorists who are plotting to kill us, but Trump said no. I'm not going to be like Obama and just give you mounds and billions of dollars worth of cash. I'm just going to shut your shit down because you're not running me anymore. You're not running this anymore. It's like Trump is walking in and he's like, bitch, back up. I got this. And you have like all these like wannabe little gangsters on the sidelines. Like Trump's just like, boosh, 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 step aside. And it's like you have like all these little posers, wannabes crumbling around him. And it's like, he's not playing, you guys. When he said, do not attack America, do not attack Americans, he wasn't playing. We know Obama brought you cash loads, billions of dollars, and you got to build your, your regime, your Islamic Republic state against America, because that's what Obama's a part. Him... Rashid Tlaib, Ilhan Omar. Okay, it's been a 30-year agenda to turn the United States into Islamic Republic State. Why do you think there's no God, but we have to respect Muslims in prayer and flights get shut down, schools have to have special places where they stop everything for Muslim prayer, but you can't say God? If you burn the American flag in America, they praise you. But if you burn the LGBTQ, bitch, you're getting 16 years in jail. This is what it's come to. So you have a president who said, no, dude, you're bad. You're not going to threaten my country, my people. Took him out. No Benghazi like Hillary Hillary. It was done. Done deal. Bam, bam, bam. Threat gone. But you have like Rose McGowan and all these George Soros lovers, fucking satanic motherfuckers, all like rallying around this whole takedown of America in support of a regime that beats stones to death women and can molest and beat little girls to death if they don't cover themselves with their job. I mean, my God, people. But in the meantime, you know, you have like New York letting people out who, okay, my dog, Molly, German Shepherd, I don't know if I just said this earlier, because honestly, I'm like Dory from Finding Nemo. I have short-term memory loss, so sometimes I'll repeat myself, but it's okay. I always catch back up. Anyways, she's eating a bone, and she's always a dramatic dog, and she's always got to be near me. Even when I do videos, you can hear like her bell and... Her collar clanking around. But she's the most beautiful dog ever. German Shepherds the best. I love them. I love them. Seriously. Love German Shepherds. They're the most beautiful souls in the world. So I don't know where I was going with this. But, dude, Democrats support terrorism. They support Al-Qaeda. They support the Muslim Brotherhood. I mean, it's all the money. Obama, right now, okay, he's out there pedal boating, looking good, trim, fit. This is what you see. Okay, then you also see his wife do the white hate thing. Him say that he stays at a Hampton Inn because he's just like everybody else, but he bought a $14 million state at Martha's Vineyard. Come on. He was just politically, you know, going around telling everybody how to think, how to act. Dude, Obama's the Antichrist. You need to trust Trump. He's not always the best guy. He can be a dick. And he can be rude. Seriously, he can. Yeah. He fucked around on his wife. He did some dumb shit. But you know what? He owned it, dude. He said, yeah, I did it. I'm an asshole. But you know what? I'm a businessman. I didn't come here to kiss your ass and make all of you people happy. And that's why Holly was mad. Because all they do is kiss ass. They're always like, mm, you, we love you. Oh, my God. Like, their award ceremonies. We, oh, the best director, and oh my God, and then, 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 Okay, people, we've been having this since the day one of Obama. It's been like, hey, we're done with it, dude. We're sick of it. 
For the sake of everybody kissing ass. It's not attractive. It's a turnoff. Can't you just be real? Like, dude, no. It's bad. People should be able to say that. It's not hate speech. It's called the truth. Anyways, love you guys. Hit that like, subscribe, and share. Love you, Twitter fam, Instagram, YouTube fam. Bye.